Hey guys, what's up? So today I'm gonna be showing you guys a really really cool tweak. So this tweak is called App Admin 14. Um, so why this is really cool is because App Admin is basically one of my favorite tweaks. So what this tweak allows you to do is when you guys go to the App Store, you pretty much hold on to the app and allows you to downgrade it to any like version that it supports. You also can find ways to downgrade it to actually any version possible as long as you have like the right um, build number or ID number or whatever for it. But you still get a lot of options just by downgrading it. So the two popular tweets are App Admin and you have by on the maps, and then you have App Store Plus Plus. So App Admin and App Store Plus Plus. App Store Plus Plus is updated. App Admin does not get updated anymore. But this should fit, or this this should be working. This should make App Admin, you know, work or fits fits it working or have a working version of it installed on eight twelve devices running iOS fourteen. So. Pretty cool. Ah, uh, see, no, my best. App Admin 14 not support A12. So unfortunately, it does not work on A12 devices, but it does work for iOS 14. It should work on. So I'll have the link down in the description. You guys just pretty much want to install the app. And it's going to redirect you somewhere. So you might have to install the uh, Yandex.dis app just to install the file. And after you guys do that, um, you guys will actually should be good. So it's going to take me back there, is it? Yeah. So you, after you guys install it, I see you press on the download button. Let's do it. There you go. See? Tap on download. And you guys would need to install a tweak called Falza. Here. Here. And then open a copy to Falza. And then once you copy it to Falza, you guys can then go to Falza and install it through Falza since it's a uh, .dev, I believe. So... So yeah, um, sorry, just responding to a message. But yeah, so um, you guys can install it through Falza. So try this out, let me know if it works for you guys. And after you guys install it, test out if it's working. I don't think there's anything in the sense for it, it should automatically apply. But you just go to the app store, you're gonna hold down, and then it's gonna come up like this. Uh, menu, the menu's similar to this, upgrade, downgrade. If it does crash, you do that, it's not working uh, for you. Just let me know down in the comments, and let me know what iris version and iPhone you're on. So I can um, see what which one is working on, which one just doesn't work on. But you yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching. I'll catch you next one. Like, comment, subscribe, and peace.